Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Abhinav and uh, in this video today we'll be inviting a special person, Dr. Rajesh. So he'll be sharing about his experience on the December FMG 2021 exam. So he has given this exam two days ago and uh, he has a lot lots of things to say to you. And over the years the FMG exam pattern has changed completely. So he'll be talking about his experience and uh, he'll also be answering about uh, what was the difficulty level of the exam, uh, what subjects were asked, how to prepare and uh, he has also has some advice for you uh, if you are preparing for the upcoming uh, FMG exams. So make sure you listen to it completely and uh, I, I hope it will be very very useful for you. So we will welcome uh, Dr. Rajesh now and let's hear it from him. Thank you. Hey hello guys, myself Rajesh here. Today I am here to share my experience regarding the FMG December 2021 with you guys. Um, I recently appeared this exam. Um, so let's talk about the format of the question and how is the pattern. So as you all guys know, uh, they used to maintain the weightage of different subjects like uh, some of the major major subjects like op surgery, the ENT, OPTHA. These uh, subjects are some of the subjects who will cover the major chunks of questions in the exam so but this time what they did is uh, it's everything mixed up guys they are nothing like yeah we have to give uh, some questions like major subjects like uh, obg should be 45 40 around question or uh, psm it is almost 40 42 questions and there is major uh, so many images um, they didn't maintain anything like that for this december exam what they did is everything is uh, so conceptualize uh, like if i will say uh, you have to understand the deep concept of this every subject and uh, the most important thing that uh, if you are still practicing like um, okay i have to choose uh, this uh, five sub five subjects and i'll prepare it very well or i'll sub or i'll try this 12 subject and i'll make it very nicely and rest of the rest, rest of the subject i'll skip please 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 my humble request don't do that I don't know what is going to happen in this future so future exams but for this for only especially I am saying this December exam what I felt personally they didn't maintain any weightage for any particular subject they mixed up everything and more accurately if I will say it's like uh, the more it is it's like more practical based guys like you have to understood understand the subject very nicely and concept concept is very good. You, you should not think that I will just, um, I'll just study uh, normally and I will I'll just uh, uh, memorize everything and I will go whatever my, my teachers are providing my notes and everything and I will finish it. As you say in Hindi, I will just go to the exam and go to the exam. No, 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 nothing like that. Just memorizing and everything is nothing going to help you and don't uh, choose subjects like okay, I have to prepare this 5, 6, 10, nothing they changed it totally and mostly they gave when i appeared the exam i felt like oh oh maybe this question it looks so easy it is uh, oh it's nothing it's it look easy but when you go through the question you read and when you go through the option they are very confusing so for that what you have to do is you have to conceptualize yourself very nicely about every subject okay uh, and no skipping of any subject that will gonna uh, put you in trouble so much what I my personally felt but uh, we have to give our best just don't think that yeah they made it so hard the pattern is totally changed maybe we can we can't nothing like that just we have to be cons cons constant in consistent in particularly some subject and if I'll say about some of the papers uh, like the paper 1 and paper 2 if I'll separately I'll say that uh, so paper 1 is like uh, they um, they combined with some of the anatomy uh, some of the yeah they give uh, this time I think more importance to biochemistry or more the pharma part yeah guys this time what is happened the every topic uh, for the every subjects they take uh, questions but they connect it with the pharmacology the drugs what you are going to give the drugs, what you go, how you are going to treat the patient, like whatever is the case, at the end they will ask about the drug, what is the treatment and uh, 
mostly treatment part yeah i said treatment like uh, some of the in the first paper if you'll say it is biochemistry some part of biochemistry microbiology anatomy uh, anatomy is not so much it's few um even physiology i was there and uh, like that but it's total mix of you know some of the pediatric some psych psychiatric questions like that it's there in paper 2 it mostly surgery uh, some of the ob gyni ent optha what is is fine there is not they are not disturbed so much like uh, how much we expect like 10 12 like that it's okay fine ent optha in the second paper i am saying surgery uh, then the OB guy needs very few guys. I can't say why they men did like that. And the PSM pictures, no logo of the PSM. PSM pictures are very uh, less. And for FSM also, the forensic medicine is also fine. It's like also few questions but no pictures. For the orthopedics also, I'll say. No so much pictures from the orthopedics also. Uh, um, but I think this time the how I personally felt is this time the paper uh, is mostly covered with so many medicines if you prepared medicine very well I think you can um, correlate with the questions very nicely so guys don't my personal um, advice to everyone is don't skip any subject from now onwards you have to prepare everything and very carefully and be strong in the concept that is the main thing concept you have to strong and keep some practical knowledge because some questions are uh, this time like that it's like so practical questions like it's it's uh, seems to us very simple we know we knew it maybe we knew it but at that time by seeing the options the four options we are getting confused and we will mark something wrong so like that uh, things are happening because we are not concept conceptually we are not that strong Maybe we know the concept. It's not like that. We are we are we are already uh, studied so much. We are doing our work so much hard, but sometimes we are not concept. We are not giving that importance to concept. Okay, I know somewhat about this. So if I'll read it and if I'll memorize it um, by four times, if I'll do the revision, I'll remember it. No, we have to also understand everything very per perfectly. Uh, practical knowledge is also important. What I felt in this uh, exam paper. Mm, overall it, it is a mixed paper i'll say both paper one and paper two it is mixed we can't expect anything that definitely we are going to get this many questions from this subject this many questions from this subject and we'll skip this and we'll read only this subject that is the final thing i want to say and rest all anyhow we are doing our work and uh, keep working hard uh, being dedicated how we used to and uh, definitely we can do everything because how many patterns they will change also never worry every time we'll prepare with something new power right so let's see what's gonna happen for the next exam and all the best for everyone who are going to appear the next exam thank you so i thank dr rajesh uh, very much for uh, coming to our uh, youtube and youtube page and uh, sharing his thoughts and i hope it was really helpful for you guys and uh, whatever doubts you have you can just drop it down in the comment section and uh, you can uh, discuss about it so thank you today uh, don't forget to subscribe to our channel see you again